Hi, I'm Dr. Anna Lintern. I'm a lecturer here at the Department of Civil Engineering at Monash University. And today, I'm going to talk to you a little bit about what civil engineering is and what a civil engineering degree can help you do in the future. So, what is civil engineering? Civil engineering involves the design, construction, and maintenance of all aspects of the built environment for the benefit of the community. So this includes things like building bridges, building dams, wastewater treatment plants, and building roads. And really, what civil engineers do is that they address the grand challenges of the 21st century. So you might be thinking, what are some of these grand challenges? Well, I'll give you a few examples. These include things like designing and planning major infrastructure projects, designing sustainable transport options, managing a water supply and wastewater treatment systems, developing solutions to the impact of climate change on our infrastructure, renewing aging infrastructure, designing smart cities, designing renewable energy solutions, and rehabilitating old mines. So if you do a civil engineering degree, what kind of job will you get afterwards? Well, you might become a water resources engineer, a rail systems engineer, construction manager, structural engineer, transport engineer, or design manager. And you can get a job at a number of different places. These might be water utilities, consulting firms, things like Vic Roads, local council, state government, Victoria's Big Build, and the list goes on and on and on. So civil engineers are really highly sought after, especially in this post-COVID world. The latest stats from seek.com show that we're on an upwards trajectory in terms of salary for civil engineers and in terms of the demand for civil engineers. So if you were to do a civil engineering degree at Monash, you'd be going into and studying in depth one or more of the four key disciplines, which are transport, water, structures, and geomechanics. In addition to this, you could study a minor in one of these three fields environmental engineering, mining engineering, or renewable energy engineering. So you can choose one of these minors as part of your civil engineering degree to make yourself more employable and to broaden your knowledge. You could even choose a minor in another engineering field of study, something like AI or robotics. So what do you learn as part of your civil engineering degree? Well, you learn technical skills. So technical things like well, how do you design a wastewater treatment plant? How do you design a road? How to design a traffic network? How to design and build a tall structure? You might be getting flashback to SimCity here. But you also get some professional skills as well. Things like how do you manage a big project? And how do you work well with others in a team? How do you write a report and present it professionally? And how do you actually speak to clients? And it's these professional skills that can be really sought after by employers, not just in the engineering field, but in other fields as well. And one of the great benefits of civil engineering at Monash is that there's a huge myriad of student clubs and teams that you can join. So things like the Monash Environmental Engineering Student Society, or ACES, which is our civil engineering student society here at Monash, or our solo decathlon team, which actually placed in the international competition the last two years in a row. Getting involved in these student teams and clubs not only make you more employable, let you test out those professional skills that we teach you, but it also is a lot of fun and helps you make lifelong friends. So thanks for watching, and we hope to welcome you to Team Civil soon. Monash.